Hi guys, so I want to share with you a small Aldi grocery haul. I have been twice recently, the past couple of days, to pick up a couple of items here and there. And I'm trying to remember what the non-food items were so I can share those things with you guys. But some of the items are Weight Watchers friendly and some of them are just stuff that we were out of or for the kids or whatever. So um, this is my second week on Weight Watchers. I lost three pounds and according to the scale home at home I lost four because of course that's without clothes. <laughs> so um, I like the program. I'm enjoying it and um yeah so my workout schedule is monday through friday i think that works best for myself and my husband it's busy but monday through friday and then we just um take a break on the weekend so that's working so let me show you what i picked up from aldi okay the first item guys and i'm just going to take it right out the box is the fit and active fresh ground turkey i noticed that they have a larger pack this is like 329 and i wanted to make turkey meatballs they did not have any last week so i picked up two of these the fit and active chocolate fudge bars i love these as a sweet treat they're a pretty good size and i need to put these in the freezer refrigerator freezer i can tell they're already melting okay guys this is one of the items that i picked up during the week they didn't have any fudge bars no, they did have fudge bars. I just wanted to try this. Or did they not? I don't remember. But I picked this up during the week, and it's okay. Jason tried it. I believe it's five or six points. But it's a really good size bar. I think this may be larger than the chocolate bar. And they also have these in raspberry, too. So I want to try that one day. And um, a lot of people must like these because I never really paid any attention, or they never were there, I don't think. So... Yeah, you can try these if you like them, um, like um, sorbet, and yeah. Okay, I am picked up some light sour cream. We're going to have chili beans, or it's just chili, but it's not super runny. I also picked up some steamed um, baby Brussels sprouts, and my mom makes these, I think, like with some bacon bits or some bacon with some onions um, like that and saute it in the pan so I wanted to try something different and new I did pick up the fresh but I was afraid that the fresh will go bad the fresh was 129 and this was 109 so I said let me get the frozen because I don't want to waste it I also picked up two bags of the steam California medley this was 99 cents and I was watching Amanda I ha I'll make sure I will she has a Weight Watchers um, channel. I was watching Amanda's channel and she seasoned these on a baking sheet with Italian, the dry Italian seasoning mix. So I want to try that. So that's why I picked up two of those. And I need to meal prep today, but I don't feel like it because I want to work on some other things. I also picked up some ground turkey, not turkey, ground beef. And then, of course, I went there. Those are my potatoes. I like making these in the oven. That was really easy to do. But anyway, I picked up the Festi Cherry Diet Coke, and I like getting these. Um, so this was my saving grace during the week, so I wouldn't go to regular. And Mama has tried, I think, the ginger lime. She said it's really good, and I meant to ask her, can I try a sip of hers when I left yesterday? Um, I think this is a limited buy at Aldi. I think it's three. Just Mama said it's a little bit more at Walmart. And at Aldi, it's a limited buy for like three forty-five. So it's not going to always be there. And they also they had this and they had, I think, the orange flavor. I think it's an orange or it. the colors were orange. So I'm not sure what it is. I also needed some more cheese for the boys. And I think this is like three points on Weight Watchers. I think it is. Okay, moving on to my other little box, because I meant to just pick up a couple things, guys. I picked up this water bottle, and they were $2.49, and they had plenty of them. I love that my store has remodeled, because now we get a whole lot of more non-food stuff, and then things get a chance to get mark marked down. So, oh, I did pick up the bookshelf. I will see if I can take a picture and insert it, and they had it in the wrong place where it was originally 39 it was marked down to 33 49 and they had the rustic one industrial shelf mixed up with the white shelf if you remember last year's the leaning bookshelf 
that they had the dark brown one so what I did was I moved it to my bathroom and I'm going to put the white one down here because I have mainly all the furniture is the ivory color um yeah and I'll show you guys that I'm working on organizing my bathroom and I'll talk about that later but um I'll show my living room when I'm finished I finally put my curtains up and I probably have everything done with Cottrell's graduation party so um yeah um so I picked this up it was $2.49 I should have got my husband one and um so my whole point of saying that was that they um have a lot more stuff it gets a chance to be marked down so i end up getting the bookshelf for like 29 dollars because it was in the, it was an inconvenience i was in the car excuse saya i was in the car and i realized that it rung up regular price but it was in the wrong place so i got ten dollars off yeah ten dollars off so i picked up two of the fit and active lemonade and then one of the fit and active fruit punch so we really like the lemonade you get I think 10 packs in here uh, where is it you get 10 packs okay I also picked up some grape tomatoes and then they go through jelly like crazy some mustard it was only 59 cent I mean you can't beat some of all these prices the onion powder 99 cents the I needed some onions losing my words 109 some spring mix I should have got two bags but a lot of times because of the new fridge our stuff gets um if you push it to the back it gets frozen but I don't want to turn down the setting because that's the setting that the guys put it when they put it in it may need to be turned down a little bit but I don't want to but um you have to be careful not to put the lettuce and stuff if the crisper drawer is full not to put it in the back also I picked up some red um seedless grapes these are like zero points and I love that when I'm adding that to a meal to make myself more full um, JJ soaked up all the popcorn already so I got him some more I love cheese so I picked up the low moisture part skin mozzarella cheese and I don't know how many points this is let me get my phone and check yeah, because it shouldn't be many, many points. Instead of getting my bok cheese, I always get some chili original seasoning mix. They didn't have any spicy. I did pick up the generic household latex gloves in yellow, guys. Um, because they were 99 cents. I know they're a dollar at Wall, um, Dollar Tree, and they got the fancy ones, but I just picked these up. The small, medium, and I thought it was neat. I was like, I don't know which one is which, but you put your hand over the arrow and it tells you the size so it's a medium and I need to I bought those because I have been washing dishes with um, bleach in them and I have not been using gloves and I can tell like the wrinkles in my thing in my hands already um, yeah what? My hands looking old and then also picked up the medium large in case my sons or my husband need to clean something which you know how it is but anyway I picked up the Italian dressing mix two of those they were 49 cents some pepperoni and some taco um, style cheese what's wrong man I picked up two of the restaurant style tortilla chips and some Tandal concentrated bleach I like their concentrated bleach and um, yeah and that's just old stuff then I also picked up some water, two things of water, and they got it. Okay, and lastly, guys, I picked up the dual pot buffet slow cooker. And this originally was, I think, $15 or something like that. And so I got it for $9. I've been in there at least three or four times recently. And I was like, this is such a great price. And I mean, it was just still sitting there. And I understand because they're small. I'm going to open them up and show you guys. I picked up two of them because I thought that was such a great price. And also because if I'm entertaining or if I'm doing something for my family, I need more of them. Also, I'm thinking about why well, I am going to use these for Cottrell's 
Cottrell's um, graduation party. And I think what we're going to do, because I was racking my brain, do I want to get it catered? I don't want to spend all this money. But then I want it to be easy for me. And um, so I think what are we going to do is do a taco bar. And I thought these would be great for that. And I know I have other warmers and so forth. But um, let me open this up and show you guys. Okay, guys. So this is what it looks like. And it is really neat and cute so it is i have to look at the box to see the quart size but it is small but it's the perfect size if you're having like um what the cashier said dips and stuff for a party or some kind of bar a soup bar maybe a sweet potato bar something like that and then it has um off warm low and high and i want to say the original price guys did i say that earlier was 14 dollars so nine dollars for a dual cooker is awesome and i usually don't have any issues with um all these stuff now i think next week i want to get and i don't have a flyer over here i want to get the grill so i'm still thinking about it the last two years i passed it up i did buy one before um again i'm not the handiest so it kind of was falling apart and i think one year i think the year i was pregnant with josiah i didn't grill out at all um maybe once or twice and and i don't know i guess oh no something ate through the whole hose on it and all i had to do was replace it and i should have but then it was falling apart anyway so i just said i'll buy another one and i think i bought the then they were selling a 99 dollar version and one that's a little bit silver and black a little more deluxe grill so i think now they just sell the deluxe grill or the bigger the silver one so yeah let me see guys what does it say for the size of this crock pot um two independent two lids two rests it has a rest i haven't put the let rest on there it has a three-year warranty where is the size of the i don't know guys i don't see the size of the court to tell you guys what it is I don't know what the court size is but if i find it i'll caption it and um yeah so it has those duals dual um knobs it has like rubber bottom feet it has the rest but it's still in the box they're right here and then um yeah you can just pull this out and that's it guys so guys thanks so much for watching um yeah thanks so much for watching i was thinking if it was anything else that i picked up to show you guys and you guys have a great and lovely week bye bye